GOP candidates face New Hampshire voters next Tuesday. And here's a look at today's new poll there. Mitt Romney way ahead, but Rick Santorum is coming on strong after his unexpected virtual tie with Romney this week in Iowa. Santorum is at 11 percent now, but look at this. He had just 3 percent this past Monday, January 2nd. The very conservative former Pennsylvania senator is getting a lot of attention, and Dean Reynolds is chasing his campaign in New Hampshire. Dean? Scott, that's Senator Santorum behind me on the podium now, and he's been talking up economic solutions here in New Hampshire. But over the last couple of days, virtually everywhere he goes, he's getting questions about his social agenda and opposition to gay marriage. Thank you so much. Okay, thank you. Nice meeting you. The senator rarely volunteers his views on homosexuality at campaign stops, but the crowds he addresses here regularly raise the subject. You say that gay men shouldn't be able to be married, have adopt kids, and be allowed to serve in the military. But I have a question, too, and it's about gay people. Today in Keene, New Hampshire, a question was asked on whether gay people should be allowed to marry. It's discrimination to deny rights. I don't want to deny any rights to anyone. Everyone has a right to live their life. That doesn't mean that they're entitled to certain privileges that society gives for certain benefits that society obtains from those, from those relationships. For the record, Santorum believes marriage should be between a man and a woman only. Why? Because I believe we are made that way. Santorum also opposes abortion, including in cases of rape. And he's spoken of the dangers of contraception or birth control as, quote, a license to do things in a sexual realm that is counter to how things are supposed to be. We have to Those who raise the issues are mostly the young and sometimes it gets heated. So anyone can marry anybody else. Okay? So anybody can marry anybody else. So anybody can marry several people. Every oh, wait, 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 stop. No, it's not for this party. We're not going to do this. Now, it may just be that he's in a different state, but it looks like the positions that helped Santorum win over evangelicals in Iowa have energized his opponents here in New Hampshire. New, Scott? Ham New Hampshire vote on Tuesday. Dean, thanks very much.